Well, the Green Fair Folk Festival has become a bit of a tradition in Little Falls. The festival is celebrating 10 years of sharing their healthy lifestyle message, and that was held at the St. Francis Convent. Our Logan Gay made a trip to the festival to check out some of their new healthy attractions. The Green Fair Folk Festival welcomed almost 1,000 people this year. This is the 10th year for the festival and has become one of the most anticipated environmentally friendly festivals around. It's an attempt to just help people live more in, in, a, in a more sustainable manner, more taking care of the earth, more appreciative of the gifts of the earth and, and walking more gently on the earth. Over 50 vendors shared information on green sustainable products and of course there was delicious food. A lot of them are, you know, providing advice, providing education on things. Some, many of them are selling products, but they're earth, what I would call earth-friendly products. Although the purpose of the Green Fair Folk Festival is to educate on green awareness, the festival also celebrates the abundance of local musical talent with live concerts. The Little Falls is kind of this musical gem in the middle of rural Minnesota, and a lot of times rural Minnesota is ignored. And when we started the U Rock bands like 12 years ago, because again, rural kids don't have that opportunity to, to form a band and perform together. And one of the newest attractions to the festival is this huge thank you card that community members are signing to say thank you to the Little Falls Police and Morrison County Sheriff officers. We're reminding people that we, these are the people that care for us in our community and we want to show them that we support them and care about them. Families love that the festival offers great summer activities for their children. For me it's an opportunity to be creative and kind of perform because that's what I like about being in Utah because you make a lot of good friends and then you also get to have the opportunity to be in front of people and perform with those friends. In Little Falls, Logan Gay, Lakeland News. And that thank you card will be presented to the officers Thursday morning. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.